result of the the pattern i just showed you now now this is you cut two which is the front and the back then you 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 take your um, tape root calculate this round whatever you get by five it depends on how wide you want the width of the bag is the width from here to here that's the gusset i did five you can make your own make your own shorter than that but this is small version of the yellow bag you saw the picture you saw is yellow uh, it's a yellow bag i did the small part and um, the small version of it so everything here now after i measure i measured everything i got 29 so 20 now I, I i will had allowance of one inch in case you want to put the zip and um, the down part and the zip part together so making 30. this side is the bottom if you check the picture where you will see that there's a bottom cup there so this side now is is the bottom from here to here now is six so i cut six by five inches then from here to here you know i told you to to cut 30 and i've subtract six out of it so now we have 24 24 by five this is it here then the long strap it depends on how long you want it i do all length by one and a half this is the short strap this again depends on how big this one is you can see my own very short so i did 13 by one and a half um i guess that is okay that is all now in the zip part i don't want joining here now you know this is 20 this is 24 from here i will deduct from here i deducted um five and a half from here five and a half this is the mark over here then half of this bag now half of the gusset is five and um, five and um, two and a half this is the measurement here this is the, this straight line here because this is where i will cut and insert my zip so when you when you got when you get this straight line this is five and a half this is five and a half then from here to here you do to see him you to do to see him now i'm going to cut it like a box i'll cut it out now so this is the outcome here yeah? i'll just if i want to sew now i'll place my my zipper here i will have added the zipper i will just place the i will insert this zipper here now and sew i will sew So this is it you can see i've already inserted my bottom cup so now i will sew mark out 0 0.25 place it on it and sew the same thing applies to this so i'll have something like this so let me sew this is the two what it does the front and the back i joined the the zippers and the bottom together added my bottom feet these are my two tiny handles you can see the way i, I just folded it since it's a tiny bag i don't really want um much drama on it so it's just two tiny tablets this is the long strap here then this is the taping taping is is like you cut one one by one by 29 you know the whole length of this is 29 so now i'm going to pass my holes this is my taping holes i'll pass it on if you have attended my class before you will know how I did it, so I'm, I'm still going to demonstrate it again. You know, I, I try, if I want to tape it now, I got a soft leather for, you can use the thick leather, but I don't have this material available again. So I decided to use 
and since i have this a soft leather soft leather is perfect for it so that you you have much much weight on your machine but sometimes if i don't have um the color available or color that matches what i whatever i'm doing i use the same material but today i have although this is not the color but it goes with this they are they, they are the same gray color but one is darker than one so it will fit in so i'll just start where the bottom starts at the middle of where i'll fix the bottom so now i will start sewing you can see the hose is already inside i'll place it in and sew so let me show you how i will do it so now
what is that about that please subscribe for my channel 